Hi! Wow! What you doing? Jesus! What the hell is wrong with you? Oh, I like you. You get to the point with no hassle. Stop it! Oh my, you're making my spirit bloom. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. Don't need to be a dick about it. Where did he go? Wait, who now? There was somebody over there! You look, look, babe, I've been here all day. You're the first person I've seen. But he was... he was... Ah, forget it. Uh, hey! The exit's that way! No, it isn't. It's this way. What are you talking about? How did you even get here? Same way that everyone does. Get a Gaylord's eye, take it to Mars, stick it into that spire thingy, then open that big honking gate in the Valley of the Kings. Why? How'd you get here? Uh... I took the train. What? What train? Come on! You seriously followed me here? Well, you're supposed to show your date your home first before calling a night, dummy. Ah, fuck me. That happens on the third date, Romeo. Ugh. What are you doing in this dump? Trying to get this damn ghost to turn on. Can't you do that in the tower? Here's the thing. I would go to the tower. I would. But I can't. Because I'm stuck on this planet. So, until I can leave, this is where I'm staying. I thank you very much not to call it a dump. But I thought you just came from Venus from the eye thingy, my bob. Oh, that was six months ago. It took you six months to chase your boyfriend? Have you tried getting Vextech to work without your ghost? That shit is complex. Your ghost died? Oh, the poor thing. Not dead, he's just sleeping. I can't get him to wake up. I'm trying lots of things, but I'm starting to run out of ideas. <laughs> sounds like me and my ex-boyfriend. Yeah, kind of like, huh? Oh, you're gay? Yeah, I'm not sure what planet you're from, bro. But the last time I checked, women who date men are not gay! Ah, sorry. My mistake. What mistake? Mm hmm No mistake. I didn't make any mistakes about anything. Especially not your gender. You thought I was a man?! Well, you do sound a bit... Anish. Oh, fuck you! Fuck you! I didn't ask for some man lady to come wandering into my house uninvited. You don't like it? Get lost! Hey, I am not a man lady. I just have some medical problems. Ah. No, 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 no. Jeez, even the speaker has more bigger balls than you. Come on, you big wimp. Get up! Not a wimp. Just a freaked out looking at you right now. Why am I too hot for you? Lady, seriously? How are you even alive? I... I don't know. Well, I suppose that does explain the voice. I mean, maybe the fire just kind of... Hey, stop it! You're freaking me out! Ghost! Wake up, you dumb fuck! Good morning, Guardian. Ah! It worked! He finally woke up. You insult your ghost to wake him up? That was all it took you to have woken up ages ago. That's right, and in the time we've been paired, you've insulted me 1,207 times to date. Smartass. 1,208. Then why don't you need to turn on now? He's been trying to get you to turn on for months. Well, he ordered me to only wake up when he spoke specific code phrase. <laughs> no, I didn't. <laughs> you, know, you know, I... Sh I just wanna say I love you. Man, I love you. Charming. Oh, look at that. It appears I need to recharge. Have a good night, sir. Uh, 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 you know what? Fuck you, you dumb fuck. You know what? Only wake up when I say wake up, you dumb fuck. <laughs> you got it. See you in the morning. Why would you do that? You told me to! I was drunk! What are your orders? Well, the ass-
asinine things you've ever done. This really takes the cake. Oh, you want to talk about asinine? I'm not the one who couldn't remember his own activation phrase. I'm not the one who thought it would be a brilliant idea to transmit rocks into the cockpit to see what would happen. And I'm not the one who... No. No. I will not stoop to your level. I don't care. It's done. I'd like to go to Earth now, please. Oh, 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 me too, me too. You need a ride? Oh, fuck, yes. You want me to call your ship from the tower? My ship's at the tower? Yes. Why? <sighs> you made me transmit rocks into the cockpit. The ship needed repairs. <sighs> it's gonna be a long week. This blows! I want to go back to the tower! Uh, of course you do. I could be training with Erica at Bearfall right now to rack up some of those brownie points, but no! I have to be stuck here with you! Alright, you know what? I am sick of your bitching. It wasn't my idea to bring you along. You have a problem with what we're doing? Take it up with Fail. And for the record, Erica's a harpy. You take that back! Who's only showing interest in you so she can make Lance jealous, which you would know if you stopped thinking with your dick for five seconds. Sorry, that was a bit harsh. Fuck than... you, man! Whatever, let's just get this done. I don't think that's fallen. Get ready, Jacob. Jacob? Ah, seriously? Fuck's sake. Alright, where'd he go? Did he fuck off to the tower? He's dead. Huh? He's dead, and it's all your fault. Ghost? He's coming for you. What is it? What? What's funny? Oh god! He was just sleeping at the... Did he just run out? Idiot. It was a little funny. And you're a bigger idiot than her. Well, we both know that's not true. Uh, okay. By the way, now that you're back on Earth, you should probably contact Fail. Uh, who's Fail? Fire team leader. Talking to fail is the last thing I want to do. Nevertheless, you've been off-world for some time. He probably thinks you're dead. And what makes you think that? In fact, he's been hosting interviews for your replacement. He what? Is hosting interviews for your replacement. Hello? Hello? Fail, it's me. What? Oh, sorry, hold on, wait. What's happening? Oh, me? You better not be... Fail! Ah, Joy, is that you? Where's my latte? You better not be using my silver to buy sterling spoons again. Wait, what's a sterling spoon? And can I have one? Fail, it's me. Who the hell is Joey? You were dead. I told you. Not dead. We looked everywhere for you. Searched the entire planet. Which planet? Venus, man. That's where you said you were. For like two seconds! I've been on Mars this entire time! Yeah, that's right! Poor Blue Boy was living in a hover for so long! Who is that? Nobody. Oh, Blue, do I really mean so little to you? After all that time spent together in your ship? Blue? Uh, yeah, it's just, uh... Well, Blue, I didn't realize you swung that way. She's a girl. Hmm, <laughs> sure is. She is! I am! You're saying you wear the pants in the relationship? I'm saying she's a girl, and it's not like that. She's just being weird. Uh, and I thought we had something special! We don't, and that doesn't matter. Point is, I'm not dead, so you can stop searching for a replacement. Right, uh, about that. No. Yeah, sorry, dude. You can't be serious. You were gone for a long time, man. We needed a replacement. Ooh. Awesome. Bullshit, you hate him. No, you hate him. I just went along with it. Hello. Piss off, Autumn. All right, then. I don't believe this. Look, blue boy, I've got to go. Glad you're not dead. We'll, um, yeah. Fuck. And you wonder why they replaced you. Mute. Is everything okay? Blue? Really, really not in the mood for your stupid jokes. 
just just go away for a little bit, okay? I wonder what it was like before I died. What? Our ghost brought us back for a reason. To fight the darkness and protect humanity. It was a job we never wanted, but it was a job we needed. I don't know what kind of life you had, but right here, right now, it's a lot better than nothing. What's your point? Look, I'll mute you, ghost. Don't be that guy. Yeah, all right. Ghost, unmute. <laughs> what? <laughs> you fuck! Sorry. You're welcome for giving you a second chance at life, you dick. Now look at what you've done. You've given him more ammo. <sighs> I know it sucks, but losing your fight team might be the best thing that ever happened to you. Life is giving you another chance to do what you want to do. God, you're an upbeat lady. <laughs> Thanks, Gully. I'm going to pretend you didn't call me that. Guardian, I've got a signal. We need to go. You do? Where? The Vault of Glass. So his signal is here then? Yes. You're certain? Oh, gee, I don't know. Let me check. Oh, you hear that? Yeah, it sounds like that beeping noise that Jacob's tracker makes. Well, I wonder what it could be. Alright, I believe you. But why did you only get a signal now? That doesn't make any sense. Nothing about this place makes sense. So... Now what? The signal's inside, Skelly, so obviously we need to get that vault door open. Oh, Don, I left my keys to giant alien vault doors in your ship. Did you bring yours? You left bits of your face in my ship. <laughs> no, 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 that's just, that's just my makeup. <laughs> makeup, really? Is that what you call it? Guardian, focus. Right, right. Uh, let me think about this for a moment. In the early days, we were able to trick the system into building a spire that opened the vault door for us. Can we still do that? We could, but a while back, a House of Wolves brute force opened the door with an explosive weapon, so building a spire isn't really an option anymore. Damn! Wait, that was an option? What do you mean? It took us flipping ages to get that spire built, and you're telling me that we could have just blown everything up? Let's just fucking do that! That's a colossally bad idea, and that's coming from a ghost who thought it would be a good idea to pair up with your stupid ass. Well, if the Fallen did it... Yeah, the Fallen did it! The Fallen that got that door open had a giant army at their beck and call to back them up when the endless hordes of Vex came pouring out. And that was when the Vex wasn't expecting company. Look, they have security guards this time. Do you have a giant army? No. Do you have highly unstable plasma rounds that I somehow don't know about? No. What do you have? I have a Nova bomb. <coughs> and a woman without a face who's convinced herself that I'm her boyfriend. Yay. I rest my case. Well then maybe... Scully? Scully! Jesus Christ. I'm not letting that on our ship. Oh, he's so adorable! Skelly. Skelly, no. It's a hobgoblin. More like hobgorgeous! I am gonna name you Sparky! She named it. I know. Fix this now before it gets worse. Skelly, I can think of a thousand reasons why it's a bad idea to want to keep an alien that wants to kill us as a pet. Starting with the fact that it wants to kill us. Oh, you're exaggerating! No, no I'm not! God knows how much blood is on that thing's hand. But it's better now! Look, he's even shooting the ground to prove that he doesn't want to hurt us! It's broken now. It's shooting the ground because it's broken. Come on, can I keep him? No. Please? No! What if I get your big dumb door open? Can I keep him then? <laughs> you're not getting that door open. But if I do, I can keep Sparky, right? Yeah. Sure. Okay. Why not? Promise? Yeah. Promise. Cross my heart, hope to die, all that crap. Hi, you guys. A friend of ours is stuck inside and can't get out. And my other friend, Blue, really misses him. So can you please open the vault for us so we can get him back? Ah, uh, shit. 
Fucking useless, I swear. I tell you to fix something and you make it worse. Calm down. Don't tell me to calm down. She's going to put a murder robot in my shit. And I just got the upholstery fixed. Hey, priorities. The door is open. We need to find Jacob. I don't even like Jacob. I got the door open. I got the door open. That's right. You did. Oh, don't you worry. I'll promise I'll take super good care of him. Sparky, stay. Stay. Good boy. God damn it. Fuck. That. The Aegis Shield. Legends say that Aegis Kabir sacrificed himself and stopped the Vex with this. Don't you think they were taking it back as a trophy or something? It's kind of weird to just leave it floating here. No, it makes sense. The shield represents Kabir's final resting place. We're in his tomb. Besides, the Vex would never let us leave with it anyway. I'm gonna touch it! No, stop! Oh, come on! The Vex will be on our ass in seconds if anybody touches that thing, you idiot! I just said, but no touching. <laughs> Fine. Thank you. Now, the signal is really strong in this room, so let's split up and find Jacob. Yeah, like that's in any way a good idea. Hey, let's split up in a big creepy cabin when it's all dark and scary, but we can stay together when it's all outside the light, when it's all calm and shit. Jacob, I know you're still in there somewhere. Let me help you. Hey, don't ignore me while I'm mocking you. Please, don't do this. Fine. We'll do it your way. Blue, what are you doing? Stay out of this, Scully. But wait Seriously, a just run. That was my favorite freak. You holding out okay? What the fuck's happened in the blue? I don't know. None of this makes any sense. Who's that? Greetings, space hag. Well, that's rude. Hey, you sound familiar. Are you here to help us? Actually, my dear, you'll be the one helping me. <laughs> your little play date with that insufferable machine. Don't worry though, I'm sure he'll call you. Autumn! What are you doing here? Hmm, what's that? Thank you for saving me. Don't mention it, Cyan. You're most welcome. Scully! Glad you're here. You can help me with... Hang on. What's with your eyes? I did a thingy! A thingy? With his eyes! I think she's been brainwashed. Scully, it's okay. Don't do anything rash. Now, I'm not one to cast around prejudice, my boy. But dare I say it, even you could do better than her. What are you playing at, Autumn? What's going on here? Good question. Why don't you tell me? That sword play was an abomination to the craft. Jacob's not here. Autumn somehow planned a false signal. Guilty as charged. Fuck you! Where is my brother, asshole? Listen, Cyan. I'm blue, you pompous ass. This isn't personal. Glimmer is glimmer. I'll see you on the other side, I'm sure. <laughs> Not today! <sighs> God damn it! Guardian down. Kelly, ah! are you okay? <laughs> hey, hey, hey now. It's okay. You're fine now. What? No, he didn't. Stop it. It's over. You two. Uh, thank you for helping. You kids are all the same. Jack should have spanked all your sorry asses. What in God's name are you thinking, son? This is unauthorized terror. Look, Astro Nut. You better have a fucking explanation of what you're. <laughs> Don't interrupt me, boy. <laughs> Guardian down. You are awesome. Damn right. And you. 
You are one brave guardian. Well done, fruitcake. Wait, what? Who the devil are you? Now what to do with you? Better not have any new tricks up your sleeve. I'm not making any promises. He's ready to distraught us all. I'm sure you didn't mean to insult you. Oh yes, I did. Right? Right. I would never. Hmm. Very well. Let this serve as a lesson then, son. Yeah. Good. Glad you two are getting along just fine. Now, if you excuse me, Sparky. So, uh, nice weather today, huh? Hmm. Ooh, um, nice helmet. Very retro. Ah, a thing of beauty. Those Chinese, I tell you, they had their heads screwed on back in the day. Sweet Mary, Jesus, and Joseph, is your plan to bore me to death? I've got news for you. It's working. Right. So what are we going to do about him? Right. The mind rapist. Mind rapist? I'm no mind rapist, fellas. That's... Not how the bum bandit tells it. I don't answer to you or that man lady. Look at her. She's making friends with that time-bending scumbot. Well, this took an unexpected turn. I like this guy. Oh, sir. Blame the victim. Oh, she's the victim. Hypnotism is a complex two-way street. She left a mark on me I'll never remove. That's enough. You lost. Have the grace to do it with some dignity. I am not at fault here. No amount of planning could have prepared me for this dusty old relic showing up. You were monologuing. When a target is at your mercy, you pull the trigger. You don't drivel exposition. I respectfully agree to disagree. Since my associate won't proceed with discussions, I will. What are your demands? What is your thingy blabbing about, bird brain? You captured us. We're prisoners. What are your demands? Well... For starters, you could apologize. <laughs> oh, come on, that's a fake laugh. It's real! So this is what diplomacy looks like. Listen here, little floating cube. What's your angle here, anyway? The angle that gets us out of this alive. Now apologize. Oh, very well. <clears throat> I am deeply sorry. Sorry for no encore! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Got away! Ah! You shot my ghost! You shot me! You shot You her. shot his ghost! What ghost? His, his ghost. ghost! Don't you know? You don't shoot a man in the ghost. That's low. Yeah, and that's coming from the mind rapist. Are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. Oh, hello. I didn't see you there. Uh, hello? Um... I like your shell. It matches your eye. Oh my god, thank you! You're so sweet! <laughs> yeah. Maybe when you aren't a prisoner we could go do something. Like what? I could give you some of my RAM. I'd like that. Ew! Mute! Damn it! Show some class. Mute. Buzzkill. Oh, they're so cute together! Ow! Now then, no distractions. Fine. It appears I am bested this day. Kill me if you wish. What? I'm not gonna kill you. Aren't you? Grow some balls and get on with it. Why would I do that? He's no good to me then. Oh, I see. You're gonna interrogate him? Correct. Then I get to shoot him. Oh my. No, 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 no. No shooting. Unless he doesn't answer my questions. Good save. Now, tell me where Jacob is. I have no idea, old boy. I'm just here to kill you. I thought that was fairly obvious. Then who sent you to kill us? Speak of the devil, there he is now. Answer it. Hello. Is the job done? Uh, yeah. They're dead. Very dead. No more blue and no more creepy manly. Ah! Joey, the hell is this? I didn't ask for dirt. Get out of there and get me a proper latte with cream. Fail? Right. Yes, awesome. Um, very good. You'll have your payment. Wait! I know that voice. Oh, bother. Fail! You furmongering traitor! Who's there? What is this, Autumn? Looks like the jig is up. You're working with them? It's not like that. It's fine. Project Seraph will get on just fine without you. Oh, come on, man. Don't be like that. He's got a gun to me, Noggin. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't want to hear it. I am one second away from shoving stuffing up your turkey ass. See? This conversation is over. I'll be seeing you. Oh, 
Good. No, no. See, that was a threat. Watch your back. That doesn't make any sense. Why would he want me dead? I imagine it has something to do with the nefarious scheme he's been cooking up. He wants you out of the way so you wouldn't try to stop him. You mean a nefarious scheme that I wouldn't have known about if you hadn't tried to kill me? That nefarious scheme? Uh, yes, that one. So you're fired now? It appears so. Pull yourself together! He's still a prisoner! Uh, yeah! You could start with all this Seraph mumbo-jumbo! Speak up! Project Seraph is the mother of all payouts. Fail will regret removing it from my grasp. There will be recourse! You're damn right there's gonna be recourse! You know where he is. Do you take me for a dullard? Of course I know where he is. Beyond the Cosmodrome Wall. Man, this blows! I want to go back to the tower! Uh, of course you do. I could be training with Erica at Bearfall right now to rack up some of those brownie points, but no, I have to be stuck here with you. All right, you know what? I am sick of your bitching. It wasn't my idea to bring you along. You have a problem with what we're doing? Take it up with Fail. And for the record, Erica's a harpy. You take that back! Who's only showing interest in you so she can make Lance jealous, which you would know if you stopped thinking with your dick for five seconds. I'm sorry, that was a bit harsh. Fuck than... you, man! Whatever. Let's just get this done. I don't think that's fallen. Get ready, Jacob. Jacob? Ah, oh, seriously? Fuck's sake. Alright, where'd he go? Did he fuck off to the tower? How the hell should I know? You didn't see him leave? I'm sorry. I was a little busy trying to ignore your bickering. This is all your fault. Why is it my job to watch your brother? Because it's my job to shoot things. It's your job to do everything else. Oh, that's fair. Your fault! Your fault. Your wow, I do enjoy listening your to fault. those two bicker. Why are you leaving exactly? Because Blue is irritating me. But doesn't he just help looking for that fallen artifact? He's a big boy. He can do it himself. I guess. It'll be fine. You know Phil won't like this one bit. So, I've been thinking about leaving Phil's group for a while now anyways. It was fun at first, but now all we ever do is go looking for stuff that Phil wants. I can't even remember the last time that Blue and I went to the Crucible together, just to blow off some steam. 42 days ago. I wasn't asking, but thanks. I just don't want to bother with it anymore. I'm sorry to hear that. Jesus! What's the matter with you sneaking up on me like that? You know that if you had any grievances with what this team is doing, you can talk to me. See, when you talk to me like that, it makes me think that I should definitely not do that. Like what? Like a politician or a dictator. Hmm, I see. That's unfortunate. The whole hiding inside buildings and eavesdropping on my conversation thing? Why are you doing that anyway? I was watching the trackers and saw that you were leaving the wall. I was concerned, so I thought I'd pop over and have a chat. Really? That's why you came all this way? Of course, and a good thing I did. Jacob, you can't leave. Yes, I can. And this entire thing that you're doing right now clinches it for me. Fail, I quit. So you can go fight in the Crucible? Among other things. Like going after that Emily girl? Erica, I, I mean, no. You've been talking to my brother, haven't you? I didn't have to. You're not exactly subtle. I don't think you realize what you're giving up. The things I can offer you, the things I'm planning, are in- Jacob! Just because my brother likes your little code names for us, doesn't mean I do. Jacob, if it all comes to pass, you'll get everything you could possibly want. Glimmer, Erica, the best damn cream lattes the tower has to offer. Lattes? Although by the time we're done, I'll suspect you have your eyes on different prospects. That sounds really vague and kind of offensive. In what way? I don't know, but like, I feel like I should be offended. Jacob, that's ridiculous. Why would you... Uh, never mind. You're smart, Jacob. Despite your emotional hang-ups. Okay, now, that is offensive. Which is why I need you for Project Seraph. Fail. You're not listening. I'm not interested. You can do your little project without me. I'm out of Sorry. here. Sorry. Perhaps I wasn't being clear. That wasn't a request. Your fault! Not my fault! Nothing is ever my fault! You can't really think... I know what I said! This isn't going anywhere. Let's just get on with finding the artifact. Yeah, you're right. I just don't understand why he'd leave. Oh, 
Over here, Cyan. On the double! Autumn, I'm blue. My armor is blue, you see? That's why people call me blue. That's what I said. Blue, Cyan, what's the difference? You're still annoying. Thank you for that. How did you make a hole in the Cosmodrome wall? And why'd you make it so ugly? It wasn't me, old boy. The Fallen made that hole. I just took advantage. Don't talk about taking advantage of holes. Zing! What do you mean the Fallen did it? I mean exactly what I said. The Fallen have been out here with a little bag of tools, hacking and slashing away at the wall for nearly a year now. Don't tell me you didn't notice. <laughs> Sorry, um, I don't speak ape. Anyone care to translate? I've been on Venus. Mostly. Watching over places of interest. Places of interest? To who? Never you mind. How are we walking through these tunnels anyway? Wouldn't it be easier to fly over? That is far too risky. Fail's got his beady little titan eyes all over this entire area. Of course, we'd have had a much easier time of it if you hadn't blown it with the Iron Lords. I don't know what you're talking about. Indeed. What? You got a drinking problem, boy! Precisely. Shh, I do not. Sorry, Blue. You do go a little over the top when you drink too much. Nuh-uh. You're delusional. You threw a sack of ice and fire tokens into the fire pit. I've never felt heat like that before, and I've been to Mercury. So? You needy took Orton's feathers off, and I got a sunburn! It's a good thing I had my helmet. I think you'd have been fine either way, Scully. I'm serious. Look. See? Good God, woman. What? <laughs> you look like my ex-wife. <laughs> Ew, Scully, gross. Put your helmet back on. The sunburn's pretty bad, wasn't it? Sunburn? I can't. I don't. Even. Where was I? You were angry at Blue. Yes, that's it. We were thrown out because of you. I think you're exaggerating a little. <laughs> we all matters, that's what's safely. <gasps> what? You're still drunk, aren't you? No. I'd wager all my strange coins that you are. I don't know what you're talking about. Blood alcohol levels exceeding 0.25%. I don't need to know that. Just bloody eat something and sober up, will ya? Fine. I'll have some raisins then. Raisins? Who the hell eats raisins to sober up? Guardian, no! Those raisins are over a year old. Eris said they're ascendant. Eris is a creepy liar. Ascendant just means they're old and gross. Eat some crackers. No! I wanna eat my raisins. Eat the damn cracker. I don't want it. No. No, 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 no. crackers. No. With the support of the new Iron Lords, taking down Fail would have been an absolute cakewalk. Alas, we were thrown out, and we can never go back. Damn it, Navy. Now I have to break in at the dead of night if I want to steal this stuff. There's only, there's only like five of Don't them. speak with your mouth full, you undisciplined swine. Oh, I have never been banned from a mountain before. Oh, then again, tell a lie. Me and my exodus. Getting awesome. banned from a mountain top that I never wanted to go to in the first place ain't no punishment. We should have gone straight here. The longer we wait, the more time Fail has to enact his Serac project. Project Serac. Whatever. The idea of that bastard scheming in his cave. Is he in a cave? Sort of. Urgh, it just makes my blood boil! What did Phil do to make you so mad thinking about him? That's between me and him. Why? what I just say? Okay, sorry. <sighs> Look, people died. Good people. Leave it at that. Oh, All right. Okay. Phil's hideout isn't far, but this entire place is infected with Seaver. If one doesn't come prepared and informed to a place like this, then it is quite possible they'll meet their end. Uh, question. What's Seaver? You're really not ahead of the curve, are you? Been hiding under a rock or something, have we? I was stranded on Mars for six months. That is unfortunate. That's how Blue and I met! His ghost was stuck in sleep mode. He doesn't like to talk about it. Ah, I see. So why was your ghost asleep? I don't want to talk about it. Hold the phone. You were stranded on Mars for six months? <sighs> yep. A likely story. But I'm not buying. Plenty of Guardians go to Mars. You simply could have asked for a ride home. 
Yeah, have you ever tried hitching a ride on Mars? Hey! Hey! Could you give me a ride back to Earth? Ah, man. Oh well, I'm sure somebody else will turn up. Oh, thank God. Hey, He's man, got desert help. madness. We should put it out of misery. I just need a ride back it could be contagious! What the hell? Get me off this uh, planet. Get me off! You want me to... What? This planet is cold and sandy. I'm sorry. Get I don't... me out of here! <laughs> Six months on that wasteland of a planet and nobody stopped to help me. Bunch of jerks. Do I count for anything? No. Oh. Well, Cyan, you see all these red tendrils and gray bits? That's SIVA. It's a tech virus that forms a symbiotic relationship with almost anything it touches so that it may spread further. It can eat its way into weapons, buildings, ships, and biological matter. <gasps> I'm a biological matter! I'm out. Whoa, 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 wait. You're out? Yeah, I'm out. That's not how this works. You go where I go. Yeah, and I'm totally fine with that when it's your life on the line. But I like living. Whatever SIVA is, I don't want any part of it. It's not quite as bad as my guardian makes it sound. Just don't let it touch you, and you should be fine. See? The little lady says it's fine. Don't be a whim. Yeah, what he said. I should be fine? Should be, yeah. My guardian's pretty good at avoiding the stuff. Yeah, well, my guardian is a clutch. Hey, he'll be fine. Right? Yes, sir. Let's get a move on, shall we? Here it is. The Plague Lands. Isn't it grand? Uh, are we supposed to be impressed? Um, yes. Um, why? Because shut up! That's why. Why are we stopping? Are we there yet? We would have been there about an hour ago if that wheeze bag of an old man didn't need to stop every five minutes. <laughs> Respect your elders, boy. I don't want to be bothered by this lava. Can we focus on the task at hand, please? We aren't here to gawk. Let's get going. Hang on there, Cyan. We need to make a plan first. Right. A plan. How about this? We storm in, we find fail, and I shoot him in the face, repeatedly. I like it. That's not a plan. This is a plan. So you guys go in and cause a diversion. Ooh. Then I take out a henchman and work my magic on another. Then, once I've got him where I want him... You blab on for long enough to get blindsided by someone you didn't see coming? Oh, come on, that was one time. I like the old man's plan better. Only maybe instead... Uh. Asshole! Asshole! Uh. Asshole! Can we actually make a plan that does not involve violence? No! no. So, I put on my sexiest clothes and charm the pants off them. Oh, hello there. Then, we can have a party together! We could all dance and, and play games, and then we could ask him what we want to know. I, I'm sure he sees how irresistible I am. Scully, that's stupid. Oh, why? It's so stupid, I'm not even going to try explaining why it's stupid. All of your plans are stupid. We don't even know where he is. Autumn said he knew where he was. Actually, to clarify, I said I know where his hideout is, but it's a big place. I think I can help with that. <laughs> Whoa! Is that live? Well, yes it is. I'm streaming this from cameras that my guardian and I hid over time. Unfortunately, they're not all at the best angle. We didn't have a lot of ideal location. You are not very trusting, are you? Trusting? <laughs> You've clearly never met Fail in person. That guy gives off some bad vibes. Yeah! 
And that's coming from the mine. Don't even go there. Man, this is so cool. I want to be able to do that. Why can't I do that? Have you checked your updates? Of course I have. Did you refresh first? What for? Need I remind you, you were in sleep mode for six months. Shut up. What's that big diamond thingy there? That is the only reason I'm even putting up with you Vanguard rejects. Project Seraph. Looks like a hunger junk to me. All irrelevant. The raw materials alone will make for an enormous profit. Probably. We can never get a consistent signal. Deductive reasoning has led us to believe that it's something to do with Fail's plan. But it could be a big ugly statue for all we know. It would if that's what we were here for. But I don't care what Fail is up to. You don't? I have a pretty bad feeling about this whole place. I just want to have some words with him. Ask him a few questions, maybe pummel on him a little bit for having a merc try to kill me. Then I'm out of here. Guardian. Come on, man. You come on. This isn't my problem. Could you excuse us for a second? Right. So back to our useful and productive conversation. Where was I? The big diamond figure is expensive. Ah, yes. Well, no. More to the point, despite what you and Navy think, spaceman. I'm ready. Actually. And I am not caring. So despite what you think, spaceman, the entire place is in lockdown. So if we want to get to fail, the odds are we'll need to shut down a large deal of the power grid. And while we're there, we can also shut down Project Seraph. You see, we'll work together to accomplish our separate goals. Isn't that nice? Wait, I'm confused. Where's the power grid? That would be located inside the complex, my dear skinless friend. So how are we supposed to get to it if everyone is in lockdown? I'm glad you asked. There's a ventilation system. Oh. That looks scary. You're a big, uh, uh, thing. Are we gonna need you to climb through it? C -c come again? You're the only one small enough to fit. But you just said I was big! Oh, you're quite petite. Just small enough for vent crawling. Uh, great. If you're afraid of the dark, you could always take your helmet off again and light the way. Quit being a jackass. Don't start. I'm serious. What is with you? Normally you'd leap at the chance for an adventure like this. Running around with a group of people that I don't like isn't my idea of an adventure. I just want to find Jacob. That's all I care about until I find him. You know this. But we don't even know if Jacob's even alive. We don't know if he isn't. I don't give a shit about Fail, but he's the one who gave us Jacob's tracking signal and sent us on a wild goose chase all over the goddamn solar system. Which now we know it was a bunch of BS to distract us while he ran around being an evil shit. Yes, exactly. He faked Jacob's signal. So maybe he knows where Jacob really is and can tell me what turned him into... Into what? Nothing. I'm just saying that maybe Fail knows where he is. That's a big maybe. Yeah, I know. But it's the only lead we've got. No, I'm not gonna let you into my mind again! You are such a drama queen. It was not that bad. Have you ever been hypnotized before? Ha! No. Then how would you know? What are you guys on about now? Can we go already? I'm afraid not. At least not just yet. Uh. Ugh. Listen here, you vapid twat wombles. It is simply too dangerous to go in there blind. We know that the power grid is safe because it's the only place we have a decent signal. Everywhere else is basically an unknown. And as I learned a few days ago, unknown to the difference between a flawless victory and getting crushed by an ancient metal-plated buffoon. And why aren't your cameras getting decent signals? I'm pretty sure there's a signal jam. Hey, that's on top of the wall! That's not fair! So while Bone Features is getting to the power grid, the three of us will go up top to break that jammer. Screw that! I'll just knock. That is an absolutely terrible idea. Well, wasn't that your plan earlier? No. My plan involved elaborate costume. Might as well let him. If nothing else, he'll make a good distraction while you two go up top. I suppose that works. This all sounds needlessly complicated. So don't insult the backup next time. Then everything will be just peachy. Whatever. Let's just get this done as quickly as possible so I can get back to searching. Cyan, we're far from done. But until we are, you have my sword. And my axe! And my broom! Why do you have an axe? And where did you even get that broom? Oh, I'm borrowing it from the sweeper bot. She's cool with it. Reporting broom stolen! Broom stolen! Everything crystal clear then? Well, actually, no, I still got- Then it's settled! <laughs> Fail must be brought to justice. Who's with me? Yeah. <laughs> Stuff on it. 
It looks all sticky. Mm, trust me, it's fine. It may look vile, but it's not dangerous. Ugh, great. And remember, once you reach a certain depth inside the complex, the comms will no longer work. You'll be on your own. Oh, even better! Ugh, it's so gross. Stupid boy who sent me to do all the dirty work. Ew! What's the matter? You didn't mention there was Seaver on the other side of the vent! Ugh, it looks like a frawl's asshole. I think I'm close to the power thingy. What I do when I get there? Hold your position until we disable the jammer. Hello? Is anyone in here? Oh, right, it's supposed to be quiet. down now. Light! Finally! Praise the sun! It feels like it's been ages since we've seen the light. Maybe if you would have moved a little faster, it would have only taken one age. It would have heard the fallen to make a bridge or two. Or you could quit pissing about for once. I don't know what you're talking about. Why is there a tank here? It doesn't make sense. Just jump over here, will you? A tank weighs tons, Autumn. This shouldn't be up here. What were they thinking? Guardian down. You two are really getting on my nerves. Death Zamboni. Carry your weight, then. Death Zamboni. What? Death Zamboni! Yeah, keep saying it. Oh, Death Zamboni. Why the hell are you guys saying? Oh, wow. That's a big Zamboni. I don't remember this. It looks like the Fallen have modified it. The Fallen? Why would they put this monstrosity up here? Why did the Fallen do anything? Maybe they're trying to take out the signal jammer, too. Elaborate on that. Well, the jammer is pretty far-reaching. It might be interfering with whatever the Fallen is doing out here. So, where are the Fallen, then? They must be on their lunch break. We better move. I think that's the signal jammer up there. Once that's disabled, Scully will be in the clear. Okay, but it's all the way up there. And? And we're not giants. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? No. That death Zamboni is there for a reason. It'd be a shame if someone accidentally turned the thing on and let the magic happen. Or I could throw a Nova bomb! What the fuck was that? I may have missed. Good job, Cyan. Good job. We need to make sure Scully is in a position before you start bombing the place, so maybe you could keep still for five minutes. You think you can manage that? It's possible. Bone features. Are can I talk there? to a ghost, Blue? Why? Because. Ugh, fine. Make it quick. Hold your position until we Hi. disable the Okay. Damn. Not getting anything. What did I miss? So, um, you know, when this is all over, do you still want to hang out sometime? Yeah, totally. Oh, no, 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 no. That is not happening. Why the hell not? Because I'd have to be there. And I'd have to be there. We'd both be there while you two do whatever it is you two plan on doing. Make little holograms together. Really? So soon? <sighs> I'm not having any part of that. But no buts. So it's gonna be like that, is it? Yeah, it's gonna be like that. 
But I just got a new hard drive! Despicable. I said put the gun down. I'm too scared. Turn around. Who sent you? What? How did you know I was here? I didn't! Bullshit. I am not going back to fail, you hear me? I don't even know who you are! Who sent you? Was it the Iron Lords? Well, they sent us away from them, and now we're here, so... Yes? You think this is funny? Sort of, but not in a ha-ha way. What does that even mean? Uh, I don't know anymore. We're here to shut down Project Seraph, and that's it. There are others with you? Yeah. Figures. There's no way you would have found your way in here by yourself. Hey! Who's been holding your hand through this? Nobody! There is this one guy. I wish he hold my hand. Do you even know what a figure of speech is? How do you know about Project Seraph? To be honest, I don't know. My friends started talking about it, and they made it seem like it shouldn't really know what it is. At this point, I'm, I'm too afraid to ask. <laughs> How did you even get in here? There was a vent. Autumn said I was the only one small enough to fit. Autumn? Oh, girl, you fucked up now. Uh, what did I say? You do work for fail. I don't, I swear, I don't bullshit. No, no, Autumn's a good guy now. Now I know you're lying. At least it was something somewhat believable. Uh, but he is. Uh, fail sent him to kill me and my friend. But then our other friend stopped him. Then fail fired him. So Autumn led me and my friends here. Go on. What? I'm not going to just stand here and prod you with questions. Keep talking. Autumn sent me to do the... to do something. I can't remember if I a gun on my face, but I do remember that whatever it is I'm supposed to do, I'm not to do it until Autumn and Blue deactivate the signal jammer. Blue is here? He's alive? Yes! <laughs> We're looking for his brother! Actually, come to think of it, he's got the exact same code as you, except it's... <gasps> Are you Jacob? Yes! Oh, thank God! Blue has been looking everywhere for you! He never shuts up about it! I'm putting my foot down. We're here for Jacob. That's it. Oh, really? I had no idea. I wasn't listening the other 5,000 times you said it. Shut up! What makes you think he's even still alive? I just know. Okay? I've seen him a couple times. Okay. When? On Mars. Venus. Here. But he's different now. I think Fail might be able to tell me what's happened to him. Wait, when did you see him on Venus? Uh, I fought him, remember? In the Vault of Glass. Uh, what are you talking about? Did that tank hit you in the head? Jacob wasn't there. Autumn faked his tracking signal. Navy. What are you talking about? He attacked me. We had a sword fight. How do you not remember this? I remember you swinging your sword around like a freaking lunatic until that big vex Blue! What? <laughs> What the fuck are they? Autumn, did you do this? No, you idiot! You think I'd start up a death machine with myself in front of it? Move! Yuch. Thank God we're not paying the bill. Sweet mother of Nazareth, get down! What for? Ow, fuck! Stop questioning me, you buffoon! Fuck! Ow! Jacob? Dude, now really isn't the time for- ah! I told you to watch out! Ah! Ah! It wasn't that bad, you baby! On your feet now! Ah! What's the bloody matter with you? It's just a little bit of shrapnel. Not the explosion, you idiot! Cyan! Ah, I don't think now was the time to put a bullseye on your chest. It, it was him! Who? There's nobody over there. Oh, forget it! I'm losing the light here! This mark is changing him. How did he get that mark? My maniac brother that you somehow didn't see just gave it to me. He needs a light transfusion from another guardian. <laughs> Well, he ain't having mine, that's for sure. Do you even hear yourself? I'm fine. You're dying. What else is new? He's fine. Let's just find fail, okay? Don't worry about it. The machine knocked down the wall. Is the signal jammer broken? No, I don't get it. The signal is still being jammed. I don't know how that's possible, unless... The siege engine is the signal jammer. Those fallen bastards! How are we supposed to stop that thing? 
we don't. What? It's going for the edge. <laughs> Dumb bird. No. So, blue and autumn are disabling the signal jammer, and you're here to shut down what exactly? I don't remember. It's got something to do with his computer. Maybe. How do you not know what you're supposed to do down here? You scared me, all right? I can't forget what I'm scared. It's a defense mechanism. Oh my god, I'm never getting out of here. Well, don't you worry. As soon as the signal's back up, Autumn's gonna come blaring on the radio, yelling about this and that, and tell me exactly what I'm supposed to be doing. You watch and see. That's not very reassuring. It is to me. Look, no offense, but why do they send you down here if you're so forgetful? I was the only one small enough to fit for defense. Oh? Yeah, so we can stop Project Seraph. I don't know what a serif is. Is it bad? You could say that. How bad? Fail uses SIVA to turn people into robots. Oh, cool! Excuse me? Oh, I mean, that's terrible! But cool. Is that what happened to you? I didn't decide to synthesize my voice for kicks, if that's what you're asking. I was one of Fail's first surviving test subjects. So what happened to you? This is my face now! That? Yeah. Like your, your entire head? What about your brain? The brain, too. Man, I wish Sparky was here. I bet he could give you some great advice about being all roboted. Sparky? My pet! Or he would have been if Blue and Autumn hadn't thrown such a fit about it. I mean, those two are just jerks. Treat me like a child. It's all Scully does the stupid plan and shut up about serving spoons. And no, Scully, you can't keep a hobgoblin as a pet. It'll blow a hole in the ship. Ray's the only one that's been so nice to me on this entire venture. I'm sorry. Scully, is it? That's not even my name! Just some stupid nickname the Blue gave me. Scully, we're not friends. This isn't a sewing circle. I didn't tell you about my head, so you start complaining to me about your problems. But we're not friends? I was literally pointing a gun at you like two minutes ago. So? Blue pointed a gun at me the first time we met. So did Autumn. Come to think of it. Friends don't point guns at friends, Scully. Oh, uh, oh, oh. I don't have any friends. What do we do? We jump. Are you kidding me? I can't jump like this. Then you'll die like this. God damn it. Ow. I don't know why I even bother. Because you like to think you have a heart of gold. Don't be absurd. I sold that thing ages ago. We did that! That's the alarm. The signal's down. Come in, Scully. The signal's down. It's all on you now. Yep! Is it done? Yep! Are you sure? The alarm is still going. You're having trouble shutting down the power. See? I told you they would mind me! Ugh. Bone features, would you hurry it up? I'm dying here! He's dying here! Shut up, I'm working! Ugh, why would you send her in for an espionage mission? She wasn't my first choice. Who would have been your first choice? Well, not her. Yet? Just give me one more! There! Power's winding down! Okay, the alarms have stopped. Have you shut off all the power? Uh, no, not completely. The system's hard to keep basic utilities running. You know, doors and lights and stuff. Yes, I know what basic utilities are. Look, just stay put until we get you. We're going into the complex. Maintain radio silence. Okay. No, no wait. What? You forgot to tell them I was alive. Oh, uh, yeah. What is wrong with you? I told you I can forget for what I'm scared. What are you afraid of now? Then I'm going to forget something else. That's a self-fulfilling prophecy, you dip. Stop yelling at me. We'll be here soon. It's fine. I'm sorry. I'm just an asshole who is selfish. Um, uh, okay. Wait, that's not right. Hang on a moment. Thank you. Oh, well, that's a bit extreme. Sorry, hang on. Testing, testing. There we go. What just happened? I've got some glitches. It's nothing. We've got to jump. No, we don't. Well, did you bring any rope? No. Ladders? No. Well, then we've got to jump now! Guardian, will you just... 
You jumped into the Hellmouth on a dare! What's the problem? My ankle's fucked up. Oh. Well, in that case... Pack it in, boys. Time to go home. Because Blue's hurt his little ankle. It's not little, it's swollen. So stay here, then. I'm going. God damn it. What's next? We should check the other feeds for fail. Look, there he is! He's heading to the perfection chamber. Nothing good ever comes to that place. What's the perfection chamber? It's where fail carves people up into its robots. Hang on. Where's Ray? I don't see him in any of his cameras. Who's Ray? He's a Titan that came to help us stop fail. If fail is going to the perfection chamber, your friend has gone missing. It would be prudent to make sure he isn't getting perfected. What about Blue and Honor? The security cameras are here. They can figure it out. Stop! What? Hide over there! Consume, enhance, replicate. Consume, enhance, replicate. Consume, enhance, replicate. Okay, we should be able to figure out exactly where everybody is from here. That's nice. What's wrong, Cyan? <sighs> I've, uh, I've lost all feeling in my hands. Can you still shoot? Uh, Ghost, could you help me out? With what? I'm having a little trouble performing. Make my finger twitch a little. How? I don't know. Shock my arm or something. I'm not going to send electricity down your arm when you're holding a gun, dumbass. Use a sword. <clears throat> okay. Let's go. This is pathetic. How do you plan on confronting Fail with numb hands and a bum leg? I imagine you would be the one doing the confronting. Oh. Unless you'd like to spare some light. Nope. My light is my light. It's staying right where it is. Then don't worry about me. I don't see Fail here. This way. There's another chamber behind this one. You take point. What about bone features? What about her? She's done her job. She's safer where she is. I think they're gone. Consume and hands. <laughs> Quit screwing around! I didn't do anything! No, you didn't! Let's go! Consume. Enhance. Replicate. Oh boy. Autumn? What's going on? I think Fail finally perfected his perfection chamber. Doing cyan. Fuck! So not great. I then. hate everything. Say it a little louder, why don't you? There's a few people on the moon who might not have heard. Fuck off. Let's just fucking get this done. Maybe you should stay here. Autumn, I'm going. I've gotten this far. You are literally on your last leg. I, I am not about to turn back now. Why would I come all this way just to leave? Hmm. Fair enough. You're a whack job, but fair enough. It's over, Fail. This doesn't have to end with bloodshed. On the contrary, 
That's the only way this can end, unless you walk away. Why would I come all this way just to leave? Really? Sounds better coming from me. Oh, I don't know. Maybe because you value your life? They're here. Bloodshed. Walk away. No bloodshed. Say that to my face, why don't you? All you had to do was to kill Blue. That was literally all you had to do. You're a failure, Alter. I have no use for failures. Leave now, or Blue isn't the only one who's gonna die today. <laughs> your threats are meaningless. You're on your own. Your project is kaput without power. I can't wait until the Vanguard pay me for this. Why would the Vanguard pay you for sabotaging their project? What? Explain, Pale. What do you mean by that? Project Seraph is funded by the Vanguard. Everything I've done here was made possible because of them. You won't see a single coin out of me or them. Yeah, right. Why would the Vanguard ever do that? Why wouldn't they? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because it flies in the face of everything they believe in? Does it, though? Yes! But does it really? You're turning Guardians into robots. How could it not? Because they are better than us. With all our power, our strength, we can still make mistakes. Mistakes get people killed, get ghosts killed, and that is not acceptable. Not with barely 10 million humans left. The Vanguard knows this as well as I do. So yes, they funded my project. They see the value in making a select few into something more. You may have stopped my project for a time, but with their help, it will be running again in no time. I won't let you do this. Autumn and I will stop you. <sighs> no, I won't. I'm out. What? If he's telling the truth, then there's really no reason for me to be here. And what makes you think he's telling the truth? It makes too much sense. No, oh, all right then. Leave. But matter, you already agreed to kill Fail, and then we came all this way, and nearly died a bunch of times. Go ahead and leave, because it makes too much sense. What was the damn point then? Is the thing. Really? Bye-bye now. Bye-bye. Bye now. Well, that's what happens when you ally yourselves with a man whose interests are purely monetary. Is any of what you just said even remotely true? No. Well... Sort of. I do believe my perfection chamber will save humanity, but no, the Vanguard is not funding it. I received my funds from all those artifacts you and the rest of our fire team found this past year. And you can't even go after him to bring him back. So sad. You think you're so smart. <laughs> yeah, I am. Then why did you send Autumn to kill me in the first place? Hmm? He wouldn't get a chance to stop me, obviously. But here's the thing. I didn't know about any of this. I found out through Autumn. If you just left me be, I wouldn't have known. I wouldn't have had the slightest idea until it was too late. Why even bother with me at all? That is an excellent question, Blue. And I have an excellent answer. <gasps> uh... How long have you been followed by a wraith? I don't know. <clears throat> what are you talking about? Yes, you do. So is this set off for good? I'm not sure. Strange. What is it? This chamber opened recently. I think there might be something inside. Stay here, Scully. Okay. Hey. What the? Autumn? Jacob? Oh, thank goodness you're not dead. You're not dead, right? This isn't some new trick of fails. No. You know, because of the face and... I know. And the voice... I know. And this isn't a trick. I found your... lady friend? Ugh. I'm not sure either of those words appropriately describes her. No, I'm not sure they do either. Then let's not use them. Anyway, she said Blue was with you. Yeah. He's in the room behind me. What's he doing in there? Oh, I don't know. Having a little chat with Fail, I suppose. Wait, what? Why? Why else? He's been looking for you. Figured if anybody knew, it'd be Fail. Better get a move on. It would be a shame if Blue caught his death before he knew you were here. Jesus, what does that mean? Something has happened to him. His body is rapidly losing light. He isn't healing like he should. Well, let's go then! We can't just leave him with Fail. What are you even doing here? Let's go! Why should I save him? 
I was expecting glimmer for all of this. But no, a waste of my time. You care more about the fucking glimmer? Of course I do. Have you met me? But he's my brother. Yeah, your brother. Your problem, not my brother. Not my problem. I'm you there. Ray? I don't understand. You can see him? I could see yours as well as you can see mine. What did you do to him? How long has it been following you? Don't talk about him like it's a thing. Jacob deserves better than that. That isn't Jacob, you idiot. How do you know? Because he's been hiding in this compound for months. He has? Yes. Little Blight has been running around, hiding, breaking things left and right. It's, it's maddening. First I wanted to find you, just so you could make him stop. At first? Well, obviously I have to kill you. Now that you've got a wraith latched to you. How long have you been able to see it? A few months now. A few months? You've had this thing this entire time and you didn't tell me? I thought you could see it. I thought you all saw it. That explains a lot, actually. What is this wraith, Vale? What is it exactly? A parasite. It finds a host and steals its light until it dies and takes on a physical form. It believed you were going to die coming here, so it marked you to drain it faster. But if I kill you first, you both die. But what about your wraith? If you're so concerned about these things becoming real, doesn't that mean you need to die too? <laughs> no. No, Blue. I don't think so. I haven't had my wraith as long as yours. Still time for me to figure out how to transfer my mind to a perfected form. Sadly, you don't have that kind of time. That's brilliant. Ghost? What? Don't get me wrong. It's still depraved, but come on. Saving yourself by becoming a robot? That's pretty cool. You love fruitcake? What? Well, don't look at me like that. You're giving me nightmares. What happened to you? Oh, this? Ha! Just but a scratch. I had worse. The bastard knew I was coming. The next thing I knew, I was stuck in that big diamond. Well, let's get going! Glad you still got a brain. Let's... Who said that? Let's see my what now? You're okay there? I... I can't stop it. What's happening to me? Oh, no. Consume. Wait! It's me! Consume. Snap out of it! Wait, please! Consume. Don't make me do this! Are you okay, Scully? It's... It's Ray. Oh! Right. I'd forgotten about Ray. Where is the old coot? Did he kill this robot? He is the robot. <laughs> oh. Oh. He was my friend! He was the best of us! Look what Vale did! Look what we, we do! <laughs> I'll pay you 500 silver coins to walk back in there! I don't know. Would be a little awkward after walking it's out like- a solid like... gold rocket launcher! <laughs> Done. <laughs> There's no other option, Blue. You have to die. I don't believe you. It seems like an awfully convenient excuse to get rid of me. That's what it was. I could have killed you dozens of times over. I don't want to do this, Blue. Ghost, what do you think? I know your light is being siphoned off somewhere else. You're gonna die either way. And soon, if you let Fail do it, at least it'll be quicker. I'm sorry, Blue. I wanted to explain myself to you, alone. I wanted you to understand, before the end, you deserve that much. Oh, fuck you! What? You and your bleeding heart. If that were true, why the hell were you antagonizing me a minute ago? You're a bastard and a liar. If you want to kill me, fine. But I'm not going to make it easy for you. Ugh. That's the way you want it. But it will be easy, either way. Is that so? Oh, thank God I was bullshitting. Oh, crap! It's all over, Fail. Your shameless exhibition is no use to anyone now. You must all see reason. Everything I've done, I've done for the greater good. The greater good?! The greatest of goods. You turned me into a thinking machine! Okay, maybe there was a little petty revenge thrown in there. A good measure. What could Ray have possibly done to you?! You made me into a cyborg against my will! And look at you now. Stronger. Faster. Smarter. You'll never get sick again. I'll never get laid again! You took his dick? You took my dick! I didn't take anything. He wasn't using it. Obviously the Seaver didn't think he needed it. My god, Fail! 
That's the one unspoken rule among rogues, thieves, and psychopathic serial killers. You never take a man's dick! Never! You're gonna die even faster now! Where is it? David! David! You've looked better. So have you. Why do you have this mark on you? Hard to explain. Uh, there's this wraith thing that marked me. Now it's absorbing all my light. And once I'm dead, it'll take my place. Seriously? Seriously. And did Fail tell you this? He explained a lot of it, but... He is a liar! Idiot. I know. Do you? Because it sounds like you just believed everything he told you. That mark wasn't made by Ghost. It was made by Fail. Hold still. I'll have it off in a second. Oh, whoa. You feel better? Uh, one second. Head rush. Um... Oh, wow. Yeah, I feel great. You're welcome. Why is Skelly crying? Adria, I I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Ghost, take me to my ship. Ghost? Ghost, do you read me? So get your guns ready, Guardians, because the burning of Lysander will be held at Bannerfall this Saturday. I concord that. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, in other news, Rogue Guardian Fail Dayton has been confirmed dead by the Vanguard. The disgraced Guardian has made a breakthrough with Seaver and used the technology to create the robotic army using kidnapped Guardians. One of the victims was Ray Clifton, a member of the Vanguard Historical Preservation Society on Venus. We go live to the Cosmodrome with Pet. Here we are at the Perfection Chamber, where the Seaver shenanigans took place. The victims were held up in a big diamond anomaly behind me and were infused with Seaver to become enhanced robot guardians. Still possessing their light, but no longer flesh and blood. I have here Joey, who is unaware of what has been going on here. So Joey, how did you meet Fail? Honestly, I met him at a random bar in the city and he liked a latte I gave him. I mean, I was on a date, but That's never... a great story, Joey! So why did you stick around with Fail and his gang? What was in it for you? Well, for one thing, the pay was... My god, that sounds atrocious! So you're saying he has you working down there like slaves? Uh, no, that's Fascinating not... stuff! So, Joey, tell me more about what your duties were working under Fail. I was only there to make lattes for him, and he goddamn hates them! I kept telling him that I don't know how to make them, but... I know I'm the victim here! You hear me, Fail? I'm the victim here! You hear me? I'm the only victim! Uh, so that's what was going on with Joey. Poor guy. Joey was an annoying prick. All he ever did was boast about how this one time he fought in the crucible with a broken sword. I bet you anything that he was carried by his fire team. I mean, maybe, but you don't know for sure. Trust me, he's trash. Well, there you go, my life savings. What did you do this time? Well, I did the maths, and I thought crushing silver coins into dust would increase their market value. Turns out I did the maths wrong. You did the math yourself. And now what ghosts are for? Oh yeah, we're just your glorified little robot butlers. Hmm. We'll give you the idea that that would work, Autumn. A Joey bloke. He had lots of ideas about glimmer and silver and strange coins. They were very compelling. Uh huh. What did I tell you? He's trash. Hey, where's Skelly? Didn't she take that death machine Sparky for a walk again? No, she's just out there. I think she wanted some space. Scully? Hmm? What you doing out here? Oh, you know, thinking about things. You did the right thing, you know. What you mean? With Ray. I've thought about what you told me, and Jacob filled me in on the rest. And I think you did what needed to be done. You did the right thing. Yeah. 
It doesn't feel like it. Right thing to do doesn't always feel that way. Sometimes even when you win, you don't really win at all. I don't belong with you, Lord. I'm better off stuck back at the Black Garden. Aw, come on, Skelly. Don't be like that. Come on, you know that's not true. Name me one useful thing I've done so far. And... Oh, oh, Sparky. You made friends out of a retarded robot. Not everyone would be that, uh, open-minded. Bone features. Davy. By Jove, you're missing it all. Joey just threw a knife right in. Uh, you're not talking about feelings in here, are you? Because you guys don't pay me enough to get involved with all that. We don't pay you at all. Scully, you're one of us. You're a valued member of the fire team. Isn't that right, Autumn? Oh, boy. What's going on out here? Oh, no. You guys are talking about feelings, aren't you? Get out, take them while you can! There's something in the air in here. Ah, God damn it. Would you just take me back to Mars? I don't want to be here anymore. Listen here, Ghost Rider. You're the first person I've seen open the vault of glass just by talking. Well... Yeah, that's right, I remember that. And you took us to an elusive Black Garden train station. You know, I'm surprised that's not in the official Vanguard map log. Oh, and you're perfect for crawling through vents. If you leave, then what the hell are we gonna do next time we have an elaborate plan involving vent crawling? We can't send either of these two. They're too chubby. You really feel like there's hope for me, even with my... modifications. It's been a while since he talked to a girl in ages. Hey! Hey, Jacob. So you didn't talk to what's her name then? Erica! Her name is Erica, Autumn, all right? All right, okay, all right. All right, okay! All right, okay, okay! okay. Uh, all right. Anyway, all right. Skelly, Jesus. we consider you one of us, you even if the Vanguard don't yeah, want you to. Good, you like can... you said to me, right here, right now, yeah, it's better than nothing. Down. You're right. All right then. Thank you, guys. All right. Guys! There's a distress call from the Vanguard! What's it about? Would you believe it? The Vault of Glass is overrun by Vex. Again. Is that really news? I mean, they do live there. Here we go again. I guess. Autobots! So I'm just kidding! Let's go! Let's do it! Hooray! I know I'm not the only one. But our guardians suck dick! I know, Thank you! I'm sick of my guardian fucking He's gonna get himself killed. I've been fucking screaming at her, but no! She has to be a bitch! It's everyone's fault! Wait... Who are you? I'm Scully's ghost. I've been muted the entire fucking time! Well, it's like... Fuck you! Denied! <laughs>